Hello everyone, it's me, Brother Randy, and I was reading in Proverbs chapter 3 and verse 19, where it reads, The Lord by wisdom founded the earth. By understanding, he established the heavens. Uh, the Lord, by his wisdom, founded or created this earth that we live on. Uh, this planet earth that we live on was founded by the wisdom of God Almighty. Uh, I know there's people out there who do not want to give God the credit for the creation of this earth. Uh, but the Word of God states differently. Matter of fact, uh, the Bible never argues for the existence of God. It simply states in Genesis 1-1, in the beginning God and uh, created the heavens and the earth. And here in Proverbs, it further states, by his wisdom he founded the earth. By his, you know, his just unimaginable, his wisdom. He's, he created this earth we live on. By his understanding, he, he established the heavens, all the, the stars and the planets and, and the uh, galaxies uh, that are in our universe. They come from the hand of God. From his hand, from his uh, wisdom uh, and his Understanding, and I was reading some commentary uh, from the on this verse of scripture. I want to share with you from the uh, uh, Reformation Study Bible, it, where, it's, where the writer states in his commentary says, "Wisdom, understanding, and knowledge belong to God, and find expression in the act of creation." The writer points to the purpose, purposefulness and design of creation. That the creation that, uh, that we see all around us here, the earth uh, and the universe that we live in was designed by God Almighty and we must ever give Him glory for it. And I want to close uh, with a word of praise from Psalms chapter 8 and verse 9 praising God O Lord our Lord how excellent is your name in all the earth Amen and Amen Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit forever Amen